Four o'clock, Sam. Time to get up. Go, oh, Dad. It's so early. Cows need tending. Chores need doing no matter how tired you are. What's it going to be? Cows, I guess. Mm. All right, Sam. Cows won't wait for a nap, Sam. Now after you fed the chickens, be sure you clean their water buckets before you fill them up. Careful, Sam. That's money you're pouring on the ground. Breakfast ready when you're washed up. Okay. Where's your pa? Oh, he's coming. Mother? Sam, you'll find it hard getting up this morning? Yeah, it's because it's still kind of new to him. Maybe we ought to buy him an alarm clock for Christmas. I don't mind calling him. Ham and eggs. Getting low on pork. When are you going to slaughter another one of those hogs? Besides that, he learns to get up now. He'll be able to keep doing it for himself someday. Oh, Ben says he can't come do it until after the holidays. Oh, I guess we can manage. He'll have it in him to be all you'd want him to be, Taff. Didn't come in to breakfast. I know. Kept it in the warming oven. Mom, what does Dad mean when he says if he gets up now, he'll be able to do it for himself someday? Why, well, I suppose it means that you won't always have someone to get you up in the mornings. He's just trying to give you something. What is he trying to give me? He's always getting after me. Well, he's... What would you like to be most when you grow up? My own man, I guess. I expect that's what he's trying to give you. Samuel, your father loves you very much, you know. It's just hard for him to come right out and say things like that. I guess it is for me, too. You know, there are other ways of saying it besides words. Like through our actions. Like with Christmas presents and stuff? But what could I get him that would be that kind of special? That's something you'll have to figure out for yourself.
dolls. Turn back to the dolls! Turn I back to the see dolls! Some dolls. I, I always want to see dolls! I hate dolls! Eh, yeah, they're halfway up the stairs by now. You got your Christmas presents figured out? Yeah, except for one. Mine? No. Don't expect to find out what it is. Just have to wait. Morning, Tad, Samuel. Uh, Howdy, Jason. Uh, better look out this milk doesn't freeze up on you. You ever rode this truck? It don't leave the milk sit still long enough to freeze. <laughs> Feels like you had some of your heifers to freshen. Two at the same time. Cash money's gonna come in handy. Yeah, there's not been too much of that circulating around here lately, has there? Huh? Well, times will get better. Samuel, look at that sky. You see the bright star? That one, right there. Imagine the star of Bethlehem must have looked something like that. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem and see this thing which is come to pass which the Lord hath made known unto us. And they came with haste, and found Mary, and Joseph, and the babe lying in a manger. Wow, all that happened in just a plain old barn. Just like ours, Daddy. Well, I don't know about that, but it shows you wonderful things can happen anywhere, even in a barn. Come on, you'd all better be in bed before Santa gets here. Come on.
time, Sam. Come on, Sam. We have to get up, even if it is Christmas. Oh, Dad. Well, don't be too long. Thought you could fool me, did you? Son, I thank you. Nobody's ever done a nicer thing. Oh, it wasn't so great, Dad. You do things like that for us all the time. Well, I reckon I can go back to bed then, huh? I don't think you'd get much sleep. Samuel. Do you know I've never seen your children when you first came down on Christmas morning? Never. I was always out in the bar. Well, I thank you, son. And I'll remember this every year, as long as I live. Well, here they come. Go light the tree. Mm -hmm. 